Hey guys, I have a video today that I'm so excited to, um, <laughs> let me just totally forget what I was going to say. I have a video today that I'm so excited to finally film. Um, the Anastasia liquid lipsticks just came out recently and they've been getting so much hype. So I picked up two of them. I wanted to try them out and I also got them in colors that are kind of outside my comfort zone that I don't usually wear. So I didn't really have them in my collection. This one is Sad Girl, that's what I have on right now, and it is a deep berry that has um, pink sparkle in it. I don't know how well you're going to see it, you can't really see it unless you get up super close. But that's what's on now. It's really dark as you can see. Um, these just have a doe foot applicator, and I don't know if it's because I got such dark colors, but they're so messy to apply like this, so you have to use a lip brush. Maybe the lighter colors aren't as bad, but I find that I cannot get, like, a precise application if I try to apply it with this. There's so much noise going on outside right now. Um, but this one is really pretty. Again, this is Sad Girl. They don't have a scent to them which is kind of a bummer because I like that vanilla scent that most lipsticks have. Um, they're a little bit sticky, which is kind of weird because these kind of kiss-proof lipsticks usually aren't, but in the same respect, they don't dry out my lips, which is nice. Um, they do... You have to kind of blot them a little bit to get that excess off, but once that's off, they're totally kiss-proof. Um, you can probably see the sparkle in it on my lips. I don't know how well I'm like breaking out everywhere today. But anyway, that is Sad Girl. I also got Potion, which is this super dark purpley eggplant color that almost looks black because it's so dark. So I'm gonna, I'll insert a picture of this on my lips as well. I will swatch it for you real quickly. Um, it's seriously, these are so pigmented, which I love, but it looks black. You can probably, it is definitely purple, but it's so dark that it looks black. These do come off easily, which was another thing that surprised me because I can get all day wear out of them. Um, I thought I was going to have to use, I recently bought this, the Sephora Oil in Gel lipstick remover to get long wearing lipsticks off, but I find I really don't need it. I can just get them off with my regular makeup wipes um, so other than that the only downside like I said is I cannot apply them with the applicator that comes with them it's just a mess <laughs> and uh, it's probably because I got the two really dark colors but I would definitely recommend a lip brush just because it makes it more it makes it easier to get a precise crisp line. If not, it's going to like want to bleed everywhere. I don't have a primer on with these. I find I don't need to use a lip primer because these are so pigmented and so opaque and they stay on so well you don't really need it. So huge, huge hit. The only thing bad I can say about them is I don't like the doe foot applicator. I wish it was a brush. But that is easily, rec easily recommended, easily remedied by just applying it with a lip brush. So. This is Sad Girl. I will put, I've put in the picture of Potion on my lips. Um, I want to get a couple more colors, but I'm trying to be good about buying tons of, like, the, tons of colors of the same type of product. Um, but that's it. I just wanted to do a little video about them and tell you how much I love them so far. Uh, this one is just, like, a foil almost because the glitter is so fine. Like, you can't feel the glitter in it or anything. It's just a really, really pretty color, so, um, and I will show you how easily it comes off with just, these are just the Walmart brand, um, Neutrogena wipe dupes. See, I don't even need to use a makeup remover to get it off. See, comes off nice and easy, very happy. I love these. I hope you guys, if you guys have tried any, let me know, because... I'm trying to figure out which other colors I want from this line, but um, my mouth looks really red now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to you in my next one.